Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another Taste Test Tuesday here at Big John TV. Thanks for tuning in. Make sure you hit that like button, subscribe early if you haven't yet. Please, if you enjoy these videos. And then if you do, share with your friends. Thank you. Uh, got a cool Taste Test video for you today. Uh, a few weeks back we did the fancy ketchups. Yep. Yeah. Right? From our friends Gourmet over... Gourmet ketchups. Gourmet ketchups from our friends over at Train of Foods. Um, they have sent us another box of goodies. And these look really good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we have a whole box of dried fruit. Fruit snacks. Um, they're so their ketchup is made with sun-dried tomatoes. And they also do the sun-drying on fruits. Right. So Train of Foods is, is out of Patterson, California. Um, we're from the Bay Area, so it's fairly close to us. Um, so it's kind of cool because it's a nice local company. Um, this isn't necessarily a sponsored video, but they did send us this product free yep. um, to review. But these opinions are our own. That and if we true. don't like something, we'll tell you whether they're sending us free stuff or not. Mm -hmm. Just so you know, you can't, I can't be bought. My opinions can't be bought. <laughs> but I'll eat whatever you guys send me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we have, like I said, we have a whole box of goodies here. A nice, healthy, alternative snack foods, both for, you know, for big, big kids and little kids. Right. So most of these are fruit. Well, I guess tomatoes technically tomatoes are fruit. fruit. But this one is savory. Right. This is sun-dried tomato strips. They're seasoned. It says that they're great on salad, pasta, pizza, rice, eggs, dips, entrees, and more. They look really good. So while she's popping that all up in this one real quick, this is the all-American mm -hmm. blend. Smell that. This is peaches, cranberries, grapes, like apples, that. blueberries. It smells like Talks about being good on salad, oatmeal, yogurt, rice, entrees, and more. Um, that's a really good idea. That smells heavenly. That smells like you just opened a bag of pizza. A bag of pizza. Pizza flavored pizza something. Pizza came in a bag? That's These are fantastic. Oh. Now see, I'm not a fan of tomatoes. I wouldn't eat tomatoes if it was just like mm. straight up. But the flavor on that so is... So much flavor. So intense. The, the taste of this is just like the Sicilian ketchup that they make. That I would love these on anything. That makes me think of a pasta dish mm -hmm. tossed in there with some like Alfredo sauce or something would be heavenly. Really good. So good. These are a winner. All right, let me pop these ones real quick. Uh, Fruitons is the name again. Train of okay. Foods. Um, go to trainoffoods.com. Their website has a store locator section to it, so you can put in your zip code and find the location near you where you can find these products. I'll just take a pinch. It literally is a bag of dried fruit. I mean, that, that yeah, there's nothing yeah. there's nothing extra in there. Some hey up, child. Some of them do have some sugar added. Like, uh, I think I saw the cranberries had some sugar added, which makes sense. Cranberries sure. are pretty tart. But for the most part, there's nothing added to these. Mm, that's good. That the would be good. The colors are beautiful. That would be great in some yogurt. These are little apples. So it's like the fruit out of a trail mix, I mean, but it's just the fruit, right? But you know, a lot of times when you get raisins, they're super dry, like really, really right. rubbery. Right. But these still have a little bit of moisture left in them. They're great. These are, these are good. Okay, in the littler, littler bags here, they've got julienne apricots. Mm -hmm. I love good fresh apricots. Mm -hmm. Not too big of a fan of the dried, personally. These are a bit sour, a little bit tart. Those have an excellent tartness. But I tell you, the apricot flavor in there is just like, mm -hmm. bam, Intense. apricot. Mm -hmm. That is like so it. good. <laughs> um, what Let's else we got? Do the dried fruit mix. This is a mix of apricots, peaches, <clears throat> grapes, nectarines, pears, and cranberries. I'm gonna dig into the cherries. <laughs> so cherries here. Mm -hmm. The colors are still really vibrant. They look great. Good cherry too. It's like you could almost choose like a fruit snack, the gummy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But it's like <coughs> you know it's actual fruit, not just a, a wad of sugar. That's funny on the back of these it does say real fruit snack. There you go. I mean that that's exactly what these are like. It's like a fruit snack that you give your kids for the lunch. <clears throat> now this one I was super interested in. This is sour dusted cherries. They're sweet bean cherries, sun-dried, 
Dust it with sour sugar. Ooh. Sour. Mmm. Dirty one. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Clearly. They've got the Whoa. tartness. Woo! Like a Sour Patch Kid. Whoa. Oh, man. I love Sour cat Patch. Oh, wow. I know. Sour Patch Kids. Oh. Those are probably my favorite because I love sour. Oh. I'm okay. Oh, yikes. So, these are wholesome, no concentrates, non-GMO, gluten-free, plant-forward. And, like, the cherry is absolutely nothing added. Yeah. So, Maddie approves. Yeah. I approve. I approve of everything. I love these all. Cherries are probably on the bottom of my list. Everything else I like super much. I'm surprised I like are these, these tomato ones the as much. Of your list? No, the sour cherries are the top <laughs> of my list. But I like these. Yeah. These are these are really good. My list would go these, these. Say so what are these? So the sour cherries. Sour cherries, the um, American blend, and the apricots. Apricots. And the dried fruit. Yeah, and the dried fruit. And then I think the the all American blend is my favorite because it's like everything. Like oh, that one even has blueberries. All in it? American, yeah. Like it, it's got everything in one bite. That's a great mix. Yeah. And some it ice does cream, say, some yogurt. You can soak these in some warm mm -hmm. water to soften them too. These would be good added into like oatmeal cookies. Oh, oh. Wouldn't that be good? I may have to do that. Yes. If we don't eat them all first. <laughs> 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 all right. So thanks again to our friends at Train of Foods for sending this, sending us this box of goodies. We appreciate it. Make sure you check them out, trainoffoods.com. We'll put the link down below. Like I said, you can find a store locator, uh, find these products near you. This and the, the gourmet ketchups. Right. Those were delicious too. Um, again, I'll say it, these opinions are our own. That's for sure. Just because people send us stuff doesn't mean I'm going to be like, oh, it's the best thing in the world. If it's, if it's junk, I'm going to tell you it's junk. Okay? I'm going to be honest with you guys. That's how, that's how we roll here. But these were winners. I but enjoyed these, them. These were good. And that's it. We'll wrap it up. Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure you hit that like, subscribe, share with your friends. Catch you next time. See ya. Bye.